Hello everybody. It's been a while since I've made a video. I've, I have been posting other videos just to let you guys know I'm still around. I'm still breathing and everything. <laughs> uh, reposted some old ones. Found some fun ones I thought you guys might like. Stuff like that. But it's been a while since I've done a video like this. Now, what I want to talk about today is weird dreams I've been having lately. First, I'm going to tell you about an old dream that made me really sad. It was in 2003. And in the dream, I was, uh, it was me and my mother. And we're driving down a really dark highway. And I remember there was a car behind us that wanted to pass us. And it did. It passed us on the left. It passed us, but then it wouldn't go in front of us. Instead, it slowed down and it started coming up to the side of our car. And as, as it's backing up, I realized that the, whoever's in the passenger seat is holding a gun out the window. And before I could say anything, bang, my mother gets shot in the head. She slumps over into my lap and I, and I woke up and I was like, what the hell? And it freaked me out. I cried like a baby. I called up my brother. I told him what happened and everything. I was freaking out, man. I was like, this, you know, and what makes that dream even crazier is the fact that, well, I had that dream in 2003. My mother actually passed away of cancer in 1998. So I was like, wow, I had to see my mom die like all over again. Only this time she was shot instead of, you know, cancer. And I was like, what was the purpose of that dream? I just didn't get it. And uh, I guess I should have looked it up, but I, I'm, I'm kind of too afraid to, you know. But that was, yeah, that was a pretty jacked up dream. Another one that I had, I had just uh, two nights ago. Most bizarre dream I ever had in my life. I don't know what to make of it. And it had something to do, somehow I was witnessing some sort of ritual by some, I don't know, Illuminati type group, I guess. I don't know. And what they did was they gave this guy named James, James Reens, R-E-E-N-S. That was his name in the dream. And it was, it was like I was watching a documentary and this guy takes this drug so that he could partake in this, uh, in this ritual. And the drug was an inhaler. They gave him a, this mask or whatever to put on his face so he could suck it in. And once he did that, he, he would, he became hypnotic or whatever. And they, they, part of the ritual was they had to cut part of his face off. The front part of his face. And they had some doctor on standby so that they could fix his eyes so his eyes would get cut along with his face. And apparently the guy could still talk. Because he, after succeeding in this ritual, whatever it was, he wanted more of the inhaled. And like I said, it was shot like a documentary in my head. And you could hear the narrator going, yeah, that's exactly what he wanted. He went through the ritual, he succeeded. And once he was done, the first thing he said was, can I have some more of that inhaled? And I woke up. And I went, what the fuck was that? What kind of dream is that, man? That's crazy. I got so freaked out by that, I went on Google, and I taped in the name James Reams, and all I did find was uh, a couple of guys who had been arrested for burglary, but those names existed, and I was like, whoa, what, oh man, bizarre dreams, very bizarre dreams, and I, I've, I've looked up the meaning of dreams before, and to be honest, that stuff just doesn't make sense, you know? I, I can never, I look up the, the meaning of dreams and what they're trying to tell me. And that stuff is just, it's weirder than the dreams. <laughs> you know, so, hey, I could use some help. Have you ever had a bizarre dream? Comment below, tell me all about it. You know, I'd like to hear it. Uh, if you understand the meaning of dreams, stuff like that, please comment what you like below. Tell me what you think. I'd like to hear from you. It's been a while. I will try and do another video. Uh, I may not do a video for a week or two simply because I have big plans with my lady. 
Uh, I'm going to get to meet her daughter soon. I'll tell you all about that later. But right now, yeah. Please comment below. Tell me what you think. I'd love to hear from you. In the meantime, I love you all. Have a great day. Bye-bye.